module, we're going to be looking at the many ways in which uh, colonial relationships can end, particularly how different parties to the treaties have imagined uh, a kind of just resolution to otherwise colonial relationships. Um, we're going to look at the different terminologies in which um, Indigenous peoples and Canadians apply to um, different processes of decolonization, of transforming um, this relationship that we're living under now into something new. Um, we're also going to be exploring the pitfalls of those types of shifts, the ways in which um, seemingly new relationships actually impose older, more colonial uh, ways of doing things on Indigenous peoples. And very often this is dressed up in a language that makes it seem as if it's new and exciting and liberating when in fact it's much more of the same. So we're going to be looking at all of the different aspects, how we can renew relationships and how we shouldn't renew um, Indigenous Canadian relations.